Hello everyone and welcome back to Supermarket Simulator. My name is Melanie V. We are now on episode 87 and day 173. Okay, I think our shelves are mostly restocked. Have a quick look see. Yeah, everything is filled up again. So might as well go ahead and open up. There we go. And I would like some light. So much brighter in here. Okay. Let's see how our cashiers are doing. Hey, Jerry and John. Everything's looking good for today. You guys all set? Good stuff. And Joe and Jake looks pretty good too. They look so formal. They're professionals. Okay, so we are haven't gotten any customers. Here's our first customer. Welcome in, sir. Gonna get some stuff out of the freezer. Okay, and let's check out the management menu. So I was thinking about getting section 12 next, but then I decided against that. I decided to go with the license route. Now there's three options for license and they all happen at level 70 plus. Right now we are at 67. Looks like we're close to 68. So a couple more levels to go and I think um, we can get our levels higher just by purchasing stuff. So we'll definitely be doing that. But it looks like we have some children's books and other books we can get. So I think that's going to be our next option. We'll need some more shelving space for it though. But let's go help our first customer. And $46 is your total, sir. There you go. Okay, it's not quite 11 o'clock, but it's starting to pick up a bit. But I want to go check out. Maybe I should close my tail. <laughs> I want to go check out what other options we have for products. Yeah, so there is cleaner, some more uh, cleaning supplies, four different cleaning supplies. But there's also like cleaner and cat and dog food. I don't know if that's going to help. I think it might, but there's only four options there. Whereas with the books and stuff, there are six more options. So does that mean that will increase the customer base even more? And say four items would. I kind of feel like it would. So we're definitely leading towards that one. And we only have to pay twenty-two thousand to get the license versus the thirty-one thousand we need to expand the store. So yeah, I think if we just have one more shelving unit, we can definitely hold the books that we need. Where are we gonna place the shelving unit? Who knows? I mean, there is space over here, like right between here. We can just put up like two shelves. That will work. Okay, let's go ahead and open back up our tail. And let's see how busy the streets are. Yeah, there's a lot of people walking around. There's even people on the opposite side of the street. Who knows, maybe they'll head over here. But back in we go. And let's go stand at our tail and hope someone decides to come to us. Yes! Okay. Hello, ma'am. Oh, ma'am has got a big order. And 87.75. A lot of stuff, but it didn't add up to very much. But we'll gladly accept 87.75. So our goal for today, once again, I think we should shoot for 86 customers and 8,200 in sales. If we get close to 8,200, I'll consider it a win, but we'll see. Hello, sir. Okay, he's got a lot of stuff here. And your total is 157, 25, 42, 75 change. There you are. Have a good night. Okay, well, it has been a very slow day yet again. But once again, right at the end of the night, it starts to pick up. $98, sir. Have a good night. Okay, 
not as busy as I would have hoped for today. Even right now, after 9 p.m., it's still kind of slow. But we'll bring through all the customers. See if we get close to our goal, even. 275 change. Here you are, ma'am. And maybe we'll go ahead and close up the store for today. Uh, there doesn't seem to be anyone heading this way. There we go. I got another customer. Is this going to be our last customer of today? Quite possibly. Okay, sir. $90. And I'll give you this $1 extra you gave me back. I guess. <laughs> so weird. Okay, so Joe has one customer. But Jake has no one. Jerry and John, how are you guys doing back here? Of course, they're always the most popular. Okay, I guess we'll help out in the meantime. Let's get some boxes out there. Looks like we can use some more kegs on the shelf. Let's go load these up. I don't know if the guys ever really appreciate my help, but I'm going to give them some help. And we'll get some of the blue kegs out there too. Oh my goodness. They have zero respect for me. They are always just running into me. Like I'm not even there. Okay, box empty. I guess I kind of run into people too. Okay, you know I keep saying I need more lighting in here. But do I get any more lighting? No. Okay, looks like Joe's got a couple more customers there. How's it going, Jake? Yeah? Just like standing here, looking at the freezer. I don't blame you, it's a nice fridge. Okay, I think we're just about out of customers now. I think we should get some more toilet paper on the shelf. That's if we have any. Oh wait, someone's already gotten to it. No, that's potatoes. Wait a minute. There we go. Toilet paper fully loaded. Poor Joe has just been... Not Joe, Jake has been standing there doing nothing. Whilst everyone got to do some extra work. He'll be fine though. Okay, are we on our last... Is that the last customer? I should double check. I don't want to kick anyone out prematurely. Yep, that was the last customer of the day. So, for today we had 84 customers. Too short of what we wanted. And we had 7,700 in sales. I was hoping for 8,200, so we're like 500 short. Ah, not great. Vodka, cheese, and this soap had their price change. Let's see, is it this vodka? No. Um, uh, this is the one. Holy, that's quite a drop in price. I'm gonna lose a whole dollar on that. Now, this soap. Um, where is? I think both of these might be this soap. I don't really know. Let's do this one. That's not it. Uh, nor is this one. Uh, okay. And the cheese. We have so many types of cheese. I need to figure it out by the look. So let's get into the menu. Actually, let's open up the store. <laughs> Might as well have some customers going through, right? There we go. I should need to put on the lights as well. Okay, so the dish soap. That's on sale. Oh, it's dish soap durian. It's a smaller bottle. I didn't even realize that was dish soap. Thought it was hand soap, but it's not. And the cheese that is on sale or had its price change. It's the brown packaging. 
Okay, let's go get those changed up. So, brown cheese. It's over on this side. We'll get the price lowered slightly. Six dollars is good. Uh oh, that customer got it at the higher price. Didn't complain though. And let's change out the dish soap before we go serve that customer. Five sixty four. We're just gonna reduce it by a quarter. Good enough. Okay, our first customer of the day is getting some pepper and some pasta. Okay, sure, just go ahead and have some peppered pasta. That doesn't sound very good. I mean, like, if maybe you had some, like, butter in there, I guess it would be okay. But just pepper and pasta, no. I don't want any of that. Okay. Well, things are starting to pick up right now. So, right now we have enough money to afford our license. We just don't have the levels. And for some reason, our store level is down. Like, yesterday, at uh, this time when I was checking, we were close to getting to 68. And somehow we reverted. People complain. I don't know what happened. That is kind of strange, isn't it? So it's not likely we're going to be uh, getting this license anytime soon. Like if we're going backwards, we, I, we might never get it even. Oh no. Okay, let's see. Can we have someone come over here, please? We want to sell stuff too. But for today, I don't know. I think maybe I'm estimating too high for my income maybe 7700 is what's to be expected on a daily basis but i think we can get to 87 customers hopefully but we'll see well we had quite a few customers today but unfortunately most of them were just buying a few items so we're not making very much for sales today but it is now 9 p.m., which means we should be closing. Okay, ma'am, your total is 84.50. Not bad. We appreciate that. There you go. Okay, sir, 96.75, please. Most of the customers we had today were paying with cash. Wonder why that is. Okay, maybe we should go ahead and close up the store even though there is quite a few people here we'll see what's going on on the outside no one in that direction oh wait a minute there is someone coming this way hello ma'am you need to get some groceries last minute groceries were still open yeah come on in we have lots of good deals right now lots of good late night deals I promise. Please come in. Ma'am? Ma'am? Oh boy. All that work and she didn't fall for it. Okay. Well, we got a couple of customers here. Let's go ahead and get these run through. Ooh, lots of pizza. 91.25, please. Thank you, sir. How are you tonight, ma'am? That's good to hear. Your total is 107 exactly. No change needed. Hope you have a great night. Okay, well, Joe's still got a couple of customers hanging out there. Jake is all done for today, it looks like. And Jerry and John, they're on their last few customers. Oh, there's still some people shopping, though. Okay, let's go help with the loading. I wonder if we're all out of kegs now. Probably. Well, we got a couple of the yellow ones. We'll get some of these on the shelf. And done. Boy, our contribution is just so amazing. When it comes to restocking. 
Well, we are out of potatoes, as usual. I really should get another rack just for potatoes back here. And probably like toilet paper too, though we have quite a bit. Well, by quite a bit, I mean we have two extra boxes in the back. So that's something. We're out of water over here, definitely out of the keg. Probably out of chicken too, for sure. It's always the big things, right? But Joe is on his last customer now. Okay, and Jerry is just about finished his last one too. That guy has a lot though. So maybe he's not quite there yet. So yeah, I think we're going to have to reload this store like a lot. And I know definitely like when we purchase a lot of stuff, we get some store points from that. So if we get all these racks refilled and all of the back room refilled as well, maybe we can get to level 69 even. Who knows? But it's kind of disappointing that we yesterday we were at 67 and somehow we lost some ground. But maybe with some sales for tomorrow morning, we'll do better. But we'll see. Okay, um, I think that was the last customer. It is time to close up. So today we had 85 customers. Oh, look at that. We actually made our sales goal. 8,200 in sales for today. Not bad. And I think that is going to be it for today's episode. Thank you very much for watching.